Alrighty, today we're going to be doing another jewelry haul in P. All right. Okay, first we have this stretch bracelet, mall brand rhinestones. And it just stretches one size fits all. Next, we have some hoops, floral hoops. All of this is costume jewelry. I am a full time reseller on Poshmark and eBay. And my username is MCWare for you if you're interested in any of this jewelry. Again, it's mostly costume, those are about three inches. And I do sell my jewelry, buy one, get one free, with most of it listed um, between $10 and $20, with finer pieces, $30 to $50. Anything $30 and under is buy one, get one free. Okay. Next, we have a really pretty cameo piece, vintage 70s, Sarah Coventry. It is signed, and it's of a ship. Next, we have some sequins hoops, lightweight, two inches. Next, we have some pink seed bead earrings, dangly. About two inches. These cards are three inches, so it makes it easy to kind of guess what size. Next, we have some iridescent studs, depending on how the light shines. There are different colors clear, blue, clear. Vintage 90s heart earrings with black beads, post. Delicate little pearl earrings, golden, gold tone pearls. Right, we'll do the brown first, and then we'll open the bags. All right. Vintage black, have a little bit of weight, enameled, 80s. Post earrings, about an inch. Dangly crystal with a line of black enamel. Bulb ball earrings. Fish hooks. Next we have about a half inch. Half hoop purple and gold tone enamel. Very lightweight. Wooden. Lavender purple and gray post earrings. Very pretty. Tiny green centers. Gold filigree earrings post. Tiny little crystal heart earrings post. Great if you have multiple piercings in your ears. Very shiny. Vintage 70s, they remind me of Golden Girls. Pastel pink, marbled, and then solid. And they're lightweight. What do we have here? This is a newer piece. $80. When it was, oh, it is still new. Sterling silver love necklace. New, never worn. A resin artisan piece with copper wire and beads throughout it. The brand, three form. 
very unique. Let me just see it looks. Okay. Lightweight. Tiny little 14 karat gold filled, handcrafted in Oregon. Jody Coyote. Tiny little hoops, about half inch. New never worn. Pearl bulbs, dangly earrings. Little green enamel heart earrings, post. A Another, they're not hearts, but they're very similar. Just a regular standard faux diamond crystal post earrings. Looks like a carrot. Big and bodacious. Green, not green. <laughs> uh, like a gray pearl. They're actually lightweight. Statement earrings are supposed to be extremely popular this year in 2024. Dainty has been popular for the past five years, and now we're going to statement earrings. Three leaf clovers, post earrings. Okay. And we took the rest of the brown, and then we'll do these afterwards. Delicate little cat's eye pink earrings beaded. Enamel post ivory gold earrings, about a half inch. Okay, matte gold tone. They look like Chico's, although they don't say Chico's, but they remind me of some Chico earrings. Gold tone coins. Boho Festival beaded earrings. These are adorable. I was very tempted to keep these when these came in. Little, I don't, like shell maybe? They're a little bit cold to touch. Little flower earrings with shell, middle. Gold. Post earrings. Okay, these are like a garnet color. Dangly earrings. Beaded. Rouge purple with an iridescent clear bead. All right, let's get into this. We have some knocker, gold tone knocker earrings, which are right on trend. These little knocker earrings. I have several pairs myself that I enjoy wearing. These are, they look like clip-ons, but they're actually not. They have the post to go in your ear. Um, gold nugget, I think that's what they call it, gold nugget. Okay. We have one spare, which I already, here we go. I'm not sure what happened to the other. Maybe it came in, it came, came in like this. So when these do sell, I will probably just include this. So if someone loses one, they will have a spare. Wouldn't that be great if all earrings came with a spare? All right, next. Oops, we have, they look green, no writing on them. Green center iridescent dangly earrings. All right. Fine Australian crystal. By Crystal Light, very pretty. Again, if you have multiple ear, uh, earring holes in your ears, these would look really pretty up on the top. They're cold to touch. All right, let's hop through here. This is a shell necklace. Beachy nautical. Next, we have some gold hoop earrings. These are really cute. When they hang, it looks like that. 
Okay. Next we have a Made in Korea Tiny Enamel Flower Pendant. It just needs a chain. Made in Korea. Very vintage. And silver bulb earrings. Fish hook. Some more. Lots of beaded earrings. Most of the time I get 90s beaded earrings in. Pop a color. Mostly costume, which is why I sell them so reasonably. I get a deal and I want you guys to get a deal as well. This is quite unique. I'm not actually sure what it's supposed to be. If anyone knows, please let me know. It has a really nice clasp and it has a tiny little crystal there. Hmm. Is that supposed to be an initial or? It looks very well made and it feels good. Hmm. Okay. All right, getting down there. Nylon wash and wear earrings. And they actually are made out of like a bendy nylon. So maybe these were meant for children's first earrings or if you were allergic maybe to gold or metal. Okay. Blue, very cold. Um, it's, I think it's how light. Um, many times people confuse how light for tur turquoise. But real turquoise, which I do have, eventually I will be showing you the difference. But how light is like a faux turquoise. So it wasn't mined in a mine, in a mine. What they look like. They're supposed to mimic turquoise. Alrighty. Little tiny crystal dolphin post earrings. Mermaid core is still popular, as well as oyster core. This coming year. Little post earrings. Delicate, dangly, blue, half inch, post earrings. Basketball, crystal basketball for you basketball lovers. These are adorable. Look at those basketballs. They're all blinged out. Gosh, that's gorgeous. They're so gorgeous. All right. And we're getting down there. Let's just show you. Only a few more pairs. I try to keep these videos under 15 minutes, but I see we are at 13 minutes. I apologize. Vintage screw back earrings. They do have some yellowing. I'm not sure if they are supposed to be that or or they're just very old. Okay. It's two inch silver tone feather boho earrings with crystals lined up. All right. These, I think, are purple. Let's take a peek. Oh, yes. I love these kind of hooks because they don't fall out of your ears. They're like a gray. They're not purple, excuse me. Like a gray center. Oops. It's very colorful boho earrings. Again, with that really cool clip. Backing, which I think a clam hook, I think they call it. And let's see. Amethyst, turquoise, citrine, and our little red and black stone. Very cute. And we are down to the last three items. No, two items. Again, vintage clip-on earrings. I don't have too many clip-on earrings, but I have some clip-on earrings. And these type of earrings always remind me of like a themed costume type prom or type of party. Some Barella stones on there, some beads on there. Um, not too weighty. Statement, definitely. Okay, and the last item I have is a necklace by North and Main. And here's what she looks like. Boho. Moon. 
Kind of reminds me of a Kendra Scott with those type of stones. And it retailed, double-ended, oh, horn, not moon, horn with beads. North and Main Clothing Company, which I am not familiar with. Oh, yeah, horn. There we go. And focus there. And that's what she looks like. Again, I'm a full-time reseller on Poshmark and eBay. I do not list jewelry on eBay, only on Posh. And you can find me at MC Wear for You. Any questions or comments, please uh, let me know. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.